hey, I did it, and if I did it, I know you can do it, but I just passed my FAA Part 107 knowledge exam. I'm not a test taker. The last time I took a major test was 20 years ago when I got my real estate license in the state of Florida. Um, so I don't study well, definitely don't study well, and I don't test well. So, but I made a mistake because I thought I was gonna try and learn this on the FAA website. And if you just go to that site and look at it for about two seconds, you'll understand why that's a big mistake. On another note, there's a lot of resources online, um, some free, some that you have to pay for. Um, and I'm just putting, I'm gonna put all the links in the description below and I'm not getting paid, I'm not getting any benefit to telling you this, I just wanna help you because I know in the beginning it's very cumbersome to try to find information. There is a YouTube channel, it's Tony and Chelsea Northrup and they actually have a free drone certification study guide. It's about an hour and 45 minute video and it's fantastic, full of information and it's a great way to study for your test. Um, but also I recommend maybe taking an online course and they're all different price ranges. I've seen one for $2.99 that seems really great. I actually chose one as remotepilot101.com. It was $149. It's about 13 modules. At the end of each module they have a quiz there's also like a boot camp where he asks you all kinds of questions and you try to answer. And then you can actually take the knowledge test or an example of one, it's 60 questions long. You can take that and see how you did. All your incorrect questions, it'll tell you and it'll give you the right answer. And you can go back and restudy. The good thing about this is once you pay for it, you can continue to use it on down the line. And since you have to recertify every 24 months, to me that was a really good benefit for 149 bucks. Also, while you're in the course, while you're watching the video, if there's something that you need more explanation or you have a question, right there on the side of the video, you can fill out, post your question, send it to them, and they'll email you an answer back. Fantastic course, remotepilot101.com. I'll put links in the description. I recommend a magnifying glass. You're gonna need that to read the charts, even if you have good vision. I even needed it with my glasses. Now, I try, they will not let you take a smartwatch, a cell phone, or at least at my testing center. They wouldn't let me take notepad or even a pen. The only thing they would let me take in was this. Now, they did provide me with a calculator, scratch paper, two pencils, and a supplement, of course. But um, I'm telling you, I've really built this up in my mind to be worse than it was. If you study, study, study get familiar with everything that's important. And that's another thing about Remote Pilot 101. He'll tell you exactly the most important things that you need to know. $149, can't beat it. $150 to take the test. Now I'm legal, ain't gotta worry about fines from the FAA, good to go. I wish you luck. If you passed your exam or you took my advice, drop a comment below and let me know what you're doing with your drone. Are you making money with it or are you just doing it for fun? I appreciate you watching, look forward to your comments.